Hi everyone and thanks for joining me today for my weigh-in update. So I'm getting this up a little bit earlier today because I've got a bit, bit of a busy afternoon. So whilst I've got a spare 10 minutes, I thought I would do this now. And um, also I need to get stuff off my chest. So I'm going to go straight in and tell you what my results were this week. Um, so just briefly, when you've seen, you've heard what I've eaten throughout the week. Um, I have tried to reduce the fruit intake and some days I did try reducing the yogurts. Um, but at the end of the day, my argument is if it's free and speed, why do I need to reduce the intake? So the results were today, which I expected because I just don't expect any more anymore. Um, I gained half a pound. So now I'm not going to lie. I went there this morning with the feeling with, um, I discussed it with my family and a couple of friends. Um, and I went there and I thought if I gain today, then it's, it's, it's got to finish because I can't be dealing with it. It's, it's like taking over my life and it's ridiculous to get so, so upset and so anxious for a Tuesday and it's just not healthy. It really is not healthy. Um, don't get me wrong, I absolutely love Slimming World. I really, really do love Slimming World. And Slimming World got me, you know, three stone off. Um, and I'll always, always be thankful for that. Um, but I truly think, and looking, I have researched it over a few days, and I've spoken to lots of people, um, and lots of people were Slimming World members, and they've had the same problem as me where they've lost a big bulk of their weight and and then they get to like this plateau where they're not losing any more weight. And it's because if you've got quite a lot of weight to lose, Simmer World works great. Now there are a few people out there that it still works for when they haven't got a lot of weight to lose. And I think a lot of those people don't eat much at all, reading between the lines and listening to other conversations. They really don't eat much at all. Now, I don't want to go through life like that of not having to, not having to eat, you know, two apples a day or three apples a day or it, it's, you know, like if I want it, then I should be able to have it. So, so some of you may not like this and I may lose some of you. Um, you know, I truly hope I don't because a lot of you, we have like made a friendship and I know a lot of you are regular commenters and I really enjoy reading your comments. And of course there are those few that I have um, conversations with like privately on Messenger or Instagram or whatever. And we have formed like a friendship. So, but I'm sure you know where this is going. I am not gonna go to Summer World anymore. Today I had to pay for the first week. Um, and I knew that if I gained today, then that would be it. There would be no more, no more countdowns, no more paying weekly which i've never done anyway today was probably about the third time i've ever done it because i've always gone in with countdowns so as from today i am going to change everything and i'm going to be going back to calorie counting using the app NutriCheck. now if you have been following me for a long time you will know that I have done calorie counting before. I made quite a lot of mistakes in the past with calorie counting, which I won't be repeating again. Um, I went on very low calories. I went on 1,200 calories a day. 
which we all know is not um sufficient enough i mean like it's enough for a toddler um so we you know i've learned from that and i know not to think that i need to be on those low calories again also i was choosing a lot of wrong foods for my calories i know there is the argument people people say and people believe which obviously each to your own if you if you want to do that then that's up to you but i know for myself um yes i'm going to have treats obviously through throughout uh, within my calories but i'm not going to like on a daily basis because back then i used to um spend something like 230 calories something like that on a custard tart um, and I've done it quite often, so I'm not going to do things like that this time because it's not how I eat anyway. Um, so why do I need to feel that I can, now that I'm counting calories, I can use calories on that? As I say, if I want to have it, then I will have it. But I'm not going to go into this thinking that I can do this like on a daily basis. Yes, I'm still going to have things like, I don't know, a skinny whip or... Um, you know, like a sweet treat, because for me personally, I have to have a sweet treat a day, because otherwise, it's just too miserable. And then that's when, like, I'm more likely to binge, where if I can have a little bit of it, then I won't. If you see what I mean, like you see a lot of people, or I hear a lot of people, I read a lot of things, um, that they've been so good for so long and then all of a sudden they binge. Well, I just think if you have a little bit of whatever it is, it tickles your fancy, um, on a regular basis, then there will be no need to binge. So, so I've obviously filled in all my um, details into NutriCheck and I've done several TDE calculators um, and several people have um, sent me links to different ones so I'm getting you know like on NutriCheck I put in a pound weight loss rather than a two pound weight loss which if I put in for a two pound weight loss it was coming up at 1400 calories now I know quite a lot of people manage on 1400 calories but when I do it like when I'm going to do calorie counting I will you know I'll count everything it's like um my skimmed milk for example i'll still measure that like i am with Simmer world and i will be um measuring however much i think i want um and i will count the calories for that i will count calories for everything you know um all the vegetables and um like i won't count for lettuce leaves i i, I draw the line there but cucumber tomatoes onions and things like that um the only thing i won't weigh is um lettuce leaves but everything else you know like an egg i wouldn't just estimate oh it's a large egg i'm gonna i, I will weigh it so so what i've decided to do because i've had several um amounts come back to me of how many calories i should have a day and i'm gonna go in the middle and I'm going to go for 1500 calories a day, which I think is, you know, quite a, a nice amount, hopefully. Um, I've, you know, I've sat down and I've worked out different things. And I think 1500 will be um, sufficient, hopefully. So, yeah, that is my plan. I don't plan on putting on, on in, in any easier days like I had done before because then obviously it cuts your calories down so low throughout the rest of the days so for example if i wanted something oh and that's another thing i'm going to change my weigh day now to a monday um because obviously i'm going to be weighing myself at home and um i think a monday will be a better day you know straight uh, uh, start of the week a new fresh start of the week so obviously i've weighed today but next week it'll be monday 
Um, so say I wanted, which you all know, I do like a little something on weigh day. So for example, if I wanted something and I was going to be going over calories on a, on a Monday, then if I went over, say, 200, then I know then I can just knock off like 50 for a few days to get that. Do you know what I mean? So I'm within for the week. So that is the plan. So I know there's going to be some of you on here that only follow me for Simmer World. And I truly am sorry um, if you if you have come here just for that. I mean, I would love it if you have kind of come, but you're still going to stick around because everyone's weight, weight loss journey is obviously different. But we are all here for the same thing at the end of the day. And you know... And I know, and my family definitely know, that I have done everything possible um, for Simmer World these last few... I got, really, I've got to say, for six, six, eight weeks, really, you know, I have put my all into it, and it's not working anymore. I would never, ever slag Simmer World off, because it works, and it did work for me. But now I haven't got much weight to lose. Um, and to be truthful with you, I put in on NutriCheck one day last week, I put in all my food that I'd eaten for Simmer World and I put it into NutriCheck just to see how many calories I'd actually had that day. And I was quite mortified, to be honest. And before I tell you the amount of calories, I wasn't even full that day. I didn't feel satisfied. I still felt you know, like I wanted to eat. Um, in fact, I think I'd done it quite late in the in the night. And, um, you know, and I, ha and I was thinking, oh, you know, I, I want to go and get like, um, I don't know, a baby bowel or a, a boiled egg or s some fruit. But I put all this into NutriCheck and then I come up with nearly just under 1800 calories. And I wasn't even full. So I only done it that one day that week. So what I had had on the other days, I don't know, calorie wise. But if I had have had 1800 calories for four or five times in that week, I was way, way over um, calories. So, you know, you got to think at the bigger picture. And is that why? the losses had stopped or slowed down, stopped really. Um, and I was gaining because I think I was eating too much. For an example, the Simmer World lasagna is 500 calories. Now, if I had that, I would add the cheddar on there, which would be my healthy extra A. I'm not sure what calories that is, to be honest. Say it's 120, that's 620. Now, I would normally uh, have it with a salad, but a lot of people that I see, you know, on Instagram, Facebook, whatever, they might have it with a baked potato. They might have it with active fried chips. Well, that's going to be another 200, possibly 300 calories on top of that. So straight away there, your meal is going to cost you 800 calories, which on Simmer World is all totally free. And... Yes, it did work for me then, but now I haven't got that much weight to lose. It's just not working for me. And I do feel sad about it because I do enjoy Simmer World. I can't wait to get this haircut Saturday, Saturday by the way. I really enjoy Simmer World and I love um, the group. I love, you know, um, like the friendships and everything that I'd made. But at the end of the day, this journey is for me and I, I'm, I'm not getting anywhere and I'm paying out and I didn't want to pay out again another six week, 12 week countdown because let's face it, we're all like having to um, watch our spending now. I mean, everything is getting so expensive. So that was my final straw today. When I had that gain, I thought no more, no more. I've got to do it myself now. So calorie counting is the way forward for me. So, yes, yeah, so I will be um, 
you know, I'll be still eating healthily. I'm not going to say I'm going to go out and have, I don't know, fish and chips, pizza or whatever in my calories. Um, but I mean, they do say that you uh, can eat what you like for your calories, which for me, that wouldn't work. Um, but so I'm going to try, I'm going to, the only macro that I'm going to look at, I'm going to um, focus on. And I know you don't necessarily need to look at the macros, but the protein is the one I'm going to be looking at because obviously the more protein you have, the fuller you will be. So I'm going to make sure that I hit my protein target um, each day. And so that is about everything I think that I need to tell you. So I'm going to um, go now. I've got my shopping to film. And obviously that is going to now be changing to instead of sins or healthy extras or whatever. Um, I shall tell you any calories or anything that may be interesting for you to know. Um, I won't have yet changed my channel name um, or anything yet. That will be done over the next day or two because I have a lot on today. Um, so I'm not going to, so just for a day or two, bear with me because it is still going to say Slimmer World. But, and as I said, I mean, I would never, ever, ever slag Slimmer World off because it done me good. But now it's time to have a change. And I really hope that you have all seen how much work I've put into it over the last few weeks. And I'm not getting anywhere with it. So think this is the best change to do anyway I think I've spoke long enough now and I will see you all again tomorrow for this new journey and hope that um it's successful it may not be successful I may you know I may need to tweak the calories a little bit who knows I'm putting myself on 1500 calories a day which is sort of in the middle of what I have been um, like allocated, if you know what I mean. Um, yeah, so we'll see. So 1,500. I think NutriCheck gave me for a pound weight loss. I think it was something like 15.58, I think. So anyway, thank you for watching. And I really do hope that you will stick around. I mean, if you're just here for Simmer World, then... It's, you know, been lovely having you along for this journey so far, but it's just something I have to do. So anyway, hopefully I will see you tomorrow. So thank you so much for watching. Bye.